This is the three question curiosity template. Hello, hello there. This is Kim, Kim Claver, and I want to show you the question set is really a template that I use to climb to the top of six different companies over 29 years, different product lines, different companies. And I did that in less than 120 days each time. And this is the reason I was able to really go fast and figure out who's yes, who's no, who's yes, who's no, who's yes, who's no. And I want to show you how I did that because it wasn't always like that. The very first time I did this business was a water filter company about 28, 29 years ago. And my sponsor at the time, the top guy in the industry said, well, you know what you do is you basically sign up anything, anyone who can fog a mirror. And I thought, okay, I probably can do that. I had bought a $5,000 package of water filters at the time, and that's what we sold. And I was really into clean water. So I signed up maybe two, three dozen people at that level in my first, I don't know, two, three months, something like that. And I thought, okay, great, this is pretty good because they paid pretty well on that $5,000 order. I think it was like $1,200 each time or maybe $1,500. And so I thought, okay, I'm going to have my first training, show people how to do this, because there were people in my group that I had signed up who said, well, I want to sign up a couple dozen people in a couple of months, so how'd you do that? So I thought, okay, I'll have a little training, I'll show you what I did. And on the day of the training, instead of seeing two dozen, three dozen, about 30 people, there were like seven or something that showed up. And I realized that what happened to the rest of them, they all kind of disappeared. We had no refunds. We didn't have any issues with anybody. They just kind of faded away. And I thought, well, what kind of a thing is this? And when I told my sponsor, I said, you know, what do you think happened to these people? I figured for sure I must have done something totally wrong, right? And they said, oh, this is kind of normal. This is how it is. So what do you mean this is how it is? Well, this is kind of how it is, people drop out a lot of them two-thirds sometimes three-quarters and I thought okay well this is not really something I want to do and I wasn't really interested in a business where the business model is expecting that 90 percent of the people are going to drop out I had a real estate business at the time and I, I never had anybody drop out and we I was the broker and they were agents everybody was a volunteer including me there's nobody paying a real estate agent or a broker any kind of a salary you have to sell stuff you have to produce you got to you know, make transactions happen and then you get a piece of it. That's kind of how it works. And so I decided that I would change totally the approach and use the same approach in terms of recruiting for customers and clients and reps that I had done for my real estate business. That is what I learned how to do. So after that first horrible experience, I knew better than to make all these big, big promises that I really couldn't keep for people. I can keep them for me barely, but I can, and I don't want to keep promises for other people because they have to do stuff to make it happen. So my strategy was I would ask question types that were of the same sort that I used to ask my real estate agents before I hired them. And so basically what I started doing back then is ask questions and teach my people questions and start the climbs to the different companies that I had done. This is me. This is the company was still NSA. Today it's called Juice Plus. This was my second pass there, I believe, with the, uh, with the Juice Plus product in 1996. It may have been the water filter. I can't remember. Somebody took this shot because you know, I sold so many of these to customers. They said, why don't you come on stage and tell everybody, which is uh, what I did. <laughs> and then after that, the next six or seven years, I spent teaching people what I had done. And I wrote a book with a lot of the scripts called If My Product's So Great, How Come I Can't Sell It? And this is me teaching from that book. And we refined and tested these questions over and over and over till we really reduced them to just a few questions or probably maybe seven or eight altogether. And you're going to get the first three of these, which are the hardest questions of all. If you hear noise, I live on the beach and they have helicopters coming by here from time to time. So I think it's gone now. All right. This picture here is showing me and showing my partner, Vic Link, the two of us were running this business together. I had signed her up and said, Vic, let's do this question stuff that we've got. We'll do it all on Messenger. Let's see if we can win this contest. And this was a contest they ran for five months, the card sending company. And it was 150,000 reps that they had. And we beat everybody, including my upline, and took the number one and number two spot as the top recruiters in the company. And we did Nothing but these questions that I want to be giving you, the initial questions, because the opening words that you use 
basically are going to tell the other person whether you are just looking for advantage for yourself or whether you might have an interest in them or best of all whether you've got a problem solution that they are interested in and so that's really what we did and a couple of years later I signed up with another company to try it again to test the process and refine the questions further and some of you may know this was in Power Network and I was number four of I forget how many thousands of people earning there in my third month I think in the business so that's me on stage with him and again do, doing the same question set so that we could qualify people literally in moments in moments okay so I want to show you we had done that uh, and then a couple of years ago in fact last year we built something else and the top rank in that company is called crystal executive and we hit that I think on our 97 days or something like that same thing all on Facebook using messenger using this question template the curiosity question template that I'm going to be showing you when you opt in here this is what I'm going to be giving you and what you can do when you get it of the three questions I'm going to give you you can copy paste two of them and the third one you have to add something of your own of course because you have to be you're unique you're different what you do for people is different than what I do for people and so there has to be something that's unique to you and you get to do that so it's the three question curiosity template and if you want to have it and see how it works and test it yourself opt in and then you're going to be able to get that and I'll see you on the other side thanks for listening talk to you soon this is Kim Kim Flavor <laughs>